the director of Radio Biafra London has given an insight into the emergence of unknown gunmen that has been attacking security agents, killing and destroying their properties. In a tweet on Friday, Kanu posted a picture of a young man that was forced to swim inside a very dirty drainage filled with trash and said, as soon as he crawled out this filthy sewage, he metamorphosed into the deadly phenomenon known as unknown gunmen, hashtag UGM. In the last three months, hoodlums that have now been christened unknown gunmen have been ravaging security outfits in the southeast and south-south regions of the country. These attacks have led to the vet of over 50 security agents burning of operational vehicles and police stations. Kanu in the tweet said that the unspeakable evil of Nigerian army and Nigerian police created this monster that is now consuming them. They see no evil, hear no evil. Brigades are a compliance. It said, meanwhile, most Nigerians who have reacted to this, some are of the view that Nnamdi Kano is a terrorist. Why is someone saying that Nnamdi Kano is doing the, the right thing? Because security men has actually caused harm to Nigerian citizens. So hello guys, what do you have to say about what Nnamdi Kano have just said? Do you think Nnamdi Kano is actually at the right path or what is your view on this? Let's hear from you. But before then, let's hear what people are saying about the tweet Nnamdi Kano have just made. All right, he said, and the people they killed their brothers and sisters out for revenge. Is that what Kano is telling us? That these people should be clean for revenge are you sure that these people you people are killing right now in the southeast are the same people that killed the people you feel that you are revenging for you guys have to stop this enough of this unknown gunmen let's stop destroying our country with our hands he said all right someone said that yeah, this is pure truth nam the Kano have just said it all someone said Nnamdi Kano is a terrorist and it has shown in his ways he has been the one instigating all this problem here and there. During NSAS, Nnamdi Kano was the one that caused the real problem that created more trouble in the southeast. All right, someone said, yeah, why they were wondering about unknown gunmen? You reveal the truth. Are they not the one that trained unknown gunmen? These are Nigerians reacting. It's good to let them know why the UGM, that is the unknown gunmen, security agents in Nigeria has caused so much damages. It's time for them to pay or better resign and join the revolution. Oh, hey, Biafra and Odudua. Okay, someone said here, what goes around turns around. The evil that men, the evil that men do lives with them. Whatever you give a man is for him to keep. He will return it later with Jara. These are Nigerians reacting. They are still talking. This is nothing but the truth. The truth will not hide forever. All hey, Biafra. Nigerian is finished by the unknown gun, unknown gun government. A foolish terrorist is asking you people question. All right, someone said there, yeah, between who and who, what? ever happened to the to these various issues submitted brigade how many of them have seen the light of the day no less a person than the governor of kogi state castigated buari for squandering money on covid 19 when a report by erify his favorite governor which could create many jobs has been left unattended to Nigerians are still talking. Someone said here, yeah, Nnamdi Kano, so are you trying to tell us that you are the one that is training these unknown gunmen? Or what are you trying to say? Let's 
hear you say it because even without you saying it your words have shown that you and your IPOB members are the unknown gunmen someone said here yeah, that the Nigerian government have to do something very fast too because the way the things are going now <laughs> if time is not taken by tomorrow there's going to be no country called Nigeria and uh, this unknown gunmen will be worse than the Boko Haram if time is not taken. All right, someone said here, yeah, the Southeast governors and the, all the leaders of the Southeast have been making life unbearable for the Igbos because they declared Biafran nation. They refused to, they refused to applaud their sons and daughters that decided to leave this thinking country. Now, because all of them are benefiting from this so-called problem country called Nigeria, they will not want to say the truth. They allow their sons and daughters to be killed by Nigerian soldiers and Nigerian police. Why the real criminals are there in the north in Sambiesia forest cooling off, eating chicken and fried rice, he said. Okay, someone said, yeah, Buhari is a cost to this country. Since he assumed office, nothing good has become this country. You know, they said when light and darkness meet, the darkness disappear. But because the our people refused to see the light when the light was there, God now gave chance for darkness to take over this country. And that is why we are suffering today, he said. So hello guys, I'm going to drop it here. Let's hear from you. What do you think about what Namdekano have just said? Kindly hit the comment section and don't forget to give us thumbs up. Also, subscribe to this channel if you have not. Thank you very much. I really do appreciate. Bye for now.